More than 24 hours after six-year-old Braxton Williams and his five-year-old sister Briah were found safe after disappearing for two days, those children have yet to be released from our local hospital. Tonight, News for Jack spoke to the children's father, Brian Williams, and we talked to him for the first time on camera while he was at the hospital. News for Jack's reporter Eric Avignet joins us live from outside that family's west side home with an update on what's happening tonight. Eric? Yes, well, we know the children suffered from dehydration that they were being treated for. We also know that they had some bumps and bruises, so they're going to stay at the hospital overnight. Meanwhile, since we've been out here, we've seen their dad coming and going from the house to the hospital and back. For the first time since six-year-old Braxton Williams and his five-year-old sister Briar were reported missing on Sunday, we are hearing from their dad, who thanked the people who found his children. Oh, I just want to thank the city, everybody for coming out, helping me with the support of looking for my kids. And man, it was like something I hope nobody never have to go through in their life. It was like one of the worst experiences I could have ever felt as a dad. This past Sunday, Brian was preparing to grill in front of his home while his children were also outside playing in front of him. He says he briefly went inside only to come back out and realize his children were missing. They were gone for two days before searchers found them taking shelter in a nearby dilapidated pump house. Prior to being located, there were speculations that the children may have been kidnapped. But after they were found, police say the kids wandered away from the home their dad was asked what he thinks happened. I really can't say, I don't really want to comment on it. It's just, it was like a tough time. It never happened before. I can't really speak on what happened, but it's just crazy. It's just something I don't, I don't want to never happen again. In fact, he says this experience has changed the way he keeps watch over his children. It won't ever even be a split second. I'm going to keep my eye on them at every time. It won't even be a split second and not even release your eyes like for anything. It's just all eyes at all times. Now, Brian Williams says he anticipates his children being released from the hospital sometime tomorrow and obviously coming back here to their home, uh, their home where, as you can see, I don't know if you can see it off there in the distance there, uh, quite a few of their toys that are still out front. Reporting live, Eric Avignet, Channel 4, The Local Station.